Hey people, Zarthwap here, and welcome to episode 31 of Overlord, Raising Hell. Last episode, we arrived in Golden Hills, we did some things, we arrived at the Glittering Mines, and we're now going to get some more gold out of this place. So let's get a move on. Oh, one thing though, because this is episode 31, the greatest amount of episodes we've had as, as of this moment, like really, we're surpass surpassing the 30 episode mark. I'm going to celebrate this episode with making it a little longer. So yeah. Yeah, that's my little treat to you as well as just seeing the game crash. Literally just, yes, it's not a Zarthwamp 31st video celebration without the game having a malfunction. Really, that, that's just being, becoming like part of the channel. Just things crashing, things going wrong. <laughs> it just shows that some things will ever change. Like... I could be probably on my 20th Let's Play, and we I'd still be getting these sort of crashes, and I'd so and I'll still probably be getting upset. <laughs> just okay, but let's just get a move on. We have some more gold to get. Okay. Okay, more slugs. Quickly, crossbow guys, crossbow guys, go, go. Okay, we're gonna use the bombs. One. Go. Okay, and boom. Good, good. Okay, let's get get move on. Oh, and he's turned around. What the? I just want to set my minions on him. Yeah, that's how we do things in the Overlord lands. Grab some more. Ha grab some more items. Grab some more money. What the oh, go, go, go! Okay. Did not want to see that thing explode on us. Okay, let's grab some more gold. Oh, look at all that gold. Oh, yeah, we are going to be swimming in it. And like I said, we're going to need the gold because we're going to need just all sorts of things for buying tower items. Cow. Some upgrades for our weapons. That go down this router. Oh, whoa! Did not see that guy. Did not see that guy. Okay, good. Yeah, we got some more power out of it. Good. Minions, kill that dwarf. Good. If I lost a minion that dwarf because just my because the guys were just not doing their job, I would have been upset. I would have just been just furious. Was there, what the? Okay, that was an ambush. I was ambushed by a dwarf. How? How do you sneak up on me with those stubby little legs of his? How is that guy sneak up on me? Okay. Actually, no, no, no. I'm going to be smart. I'm going to search around the area first, then grab the gold. Okay, magic fountain. Cart. That. Okay, why put that little gap in that wall? I don't know, but let's just get a move on. Can one of our minions pick that? Yes, he, he needed that. He needed that just to make himself a little stronger. But, let's grab the second cart. This cart of gold. Because we need more gold. We don't have enough gold. I'm upset because we just are not... We are not wealthy enough. We need literally just so much gold. We need enough gold that we can just put it in a bag and just start using it as a weapon. For sure we have that amount, but just really, I need it to be comedically large. I need it to be like one of those comedically large bags of gold that we just swing and we just hit everything. I want us to hit that guy Khan that we saw. We just we'll hit him with a big bag of gold. You saw how big he was. He was gigantic. Just Okay. That means taking that gold back. Okay, let's just move on a little bit ahead. Get some progress done. Okay. Oh, there's a cart there. Okay, and a few explosives. Go, minion. Sacrifice yourself. Sacrifice for your brothers. And boom! That with strategy. Let's grab these this light force and get this cart back. Go minions, grab it. I need that cart back. 
Okay. Okay, good, good, good. A little more strength. That always helps out. Minions! Minions, we need gold. We need gold and we need items. So unless you have gold or items, just don't bother running back to me. Okay. Good, good. 9,000 gold. We're almost back to 10,000. That's just so nice to see. You guys get so wealthy from the Golden Hills. Just really. Okay, Chris one. Okay. I'll go get the minions who were who are running back to the warp point. Because just we can't just risk it not having our full stock of boys. Our full minion supply. Okay, where are they? Minions. Minions, come out. Where are you minions? Okay, the other nine. Okay, good. Okay, there are the ones who had the action with the first cart. Okay, we're making good time. We're making good time through the mines. Okay, good, good. Come on. Come on, we need to get this back. Smash these barrels because they could have more gold in it. Yes, I am going to do this. I am going to be greedy. I'm going to be searching all over the place. Okay. Okay, come on. Yeah, see, there's more gold! Okay, 13,000. Yeah, we have enough to buy all the items. Okay, let's just search around. Okay, I'm making the time. Let's just go down here. We cleared all the enemies, so it's just going to be a little waltz down this mine. This mine area, it's okay. I Like I said, I hate areas like this where it just feels like I'm walking through a maze. Just, where, this hallway, I'll always remember this. I don't know why, this hallway is just so distinct to me. But just, I at least enjoy this one hallway. Yes, I know, it's weird. Fair top 10 hallways in video games. Okay. Wait for it, wait for it. And charge, minions, charge! Take them out! Take them down, Archimedes! Okay, more. More dwarves. How many dwarves are there in this mine? Okay, good. Good. Okay. Grab all that gold. Oh yeah, that is just so nice. That is why I love to see just thirteen thousand pieces of gold under my thing. And ooh, what was that? That shiny over there. I want. I want the shiny. Okay, good, good. We got the shiny. Two hundred sixty-eight percent power. Okay, let's search around here. Okay, our red spawner. If we ever want to get that, but we don't need reds. I really don't. Okay, well. Why is it with these dwarves and ambushing me? Just literally, you don't hear them coming. Maybe there's gold in the chair. I don't know. This is Overlord raising hell. There, there could be gold in the chairs. Okay. Charge minions. Okay, good. Okay, let's just ransack this place. Get as much as we can out of it. Okay, 270, that's pretty good. We're gaining up stock. Mo another shiny, let's see if any more minions can pick it up. Okay, yeah, see, look at that. Look at that. Okay. Hm. That's a big dwarf right there, I think. Okay. Okay, go minion. Go, charge. I'll be behind you. Go, 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 take it out, take out that crossbow, good. Good, we did not lose, lose any minions. Okay, let's just slam some more things, ransack, search around, search around, search around. Okay, another gate. Okay, we went down that way, literally, just, I hate when they do things like that. It just deceives you, it mixes you up, it just throws you off. Okay, good. Let's charge him. 
Okay, regroup the minions. The worst thing you can do is just be overconfident. Okay, good, good. Okay, let's just scan around for items. Good, okay, that's what I love to see. Hmm, what's this rod? Help us. Help us. The gold is yours. We don't want it. I think you do. Slay those beasts and free us. <laughs> oh, I say. Oh, you elves. You're going to be free, all right. Free into a slug's tummy. No. No. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Okay, good, 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 good. They're distracted. We're fattening them up with the elves. Go, 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 hurry, hurry. Go, go, go. We can do this, we can do this, we hurry. We can hurry, we can defeat the slugs without losing our minion. Good, good, good. Good. Okay. Good. We have done it. We We were good. Oh. I don't think I forgot about you. Yeah, hey, they're good life force. I'm not wasting four minions on these elves by letting them live. I have refinement. Okay. Okay. We've done it. We fed the elves the slugs. So that gets a nice check mark on the checklist of evil. Oh, yes. Good, good. Now the uh, now that I've actually taken out all of the inconvenient missions, I can now focus on story-based evil. I'm not going to need the checklist of evil anymore. I know it's sad. The checklist of evil is no more. There is no need for it anymore. Let's just cover up this hole. We don't need the slugs. We don't need the slugs. Come on. Oh, what? Oh. Screw this. Screw this, come on. Let's put nine minions on that thing. Come on. Okay, come on. You can destroy it. Oh, come on. We're one minion short. Go lift it. Go. What, what are you guys doing? You are lazy. All of you are lazy. Okay. Come on. I don't care. I'm destroying it all. I'm destroying that barrier. Good, good. You don't put it down because I don't want you to put it down. I'll feed you the slug. And don't think I won't. Because I will. I'm deranged. Partially deranged. Okay. Let's lead the way for our minions because we're almost Everyone done. Everyone likes gold, sire. But this King Goldo seems obsessed with it. Hey, who won? Hmm. We're an overlord. There's nothing to buy around here. I wonder what he's doing with it. Rubbing it all over his body, just using it into a like a Scrooge McDuck vault, vault money pool. You don't know what he does. You don't know his hobbies. You could be intimate with the gold. It could be like Sir William is Red Dawn. He was invited to the wedding after all. So he obviously has some sort of friendship with Sir William. You're, he's like a big bag of gold. And he just coddles in his bed. He speaks sweet nothings to it. It's beautiful. Hey, it's probably a better love story than Twilight. <laughs> just really, someone needs to do like a Photoshop of Goldo Golderson just putting his head face on Jacob from Twilight and just wait, putting like a bag of money on Bella's face. I, I, on Bella's body. That would just be glorious. <laughs> <laughs> or just on Edward, just Goldo and back and gold. That would just that is the shit OTP of this game. Just screw Sir William his succubus. Goldo and his gold, they are the true ship. They are truly the greatest of ships. They are the ship of kings. Okay, good. We have claimed all the gold as our own. And let's get a move on. 
<laughs> oh my god, now I can't get the thing of Goldo having some golden love toward love affair. Oh, the game's lagging. The game is lagging. Okay, we completed that dungeon, hence our flag, our sad, pitiful flag that I'm not replacing because I'm cheap. Okay, let's just go around here. Okay, smash up that barrier. Smash up, minions. Smash it up. Come on. What? What did you come on? I swear. Oh, right, right. I think I'm. I think I may be missing over something. I'm glossing something over. I don't know. I'd have to go back and check. And hey, an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure. It's better for you just to go back now and do a quick check than to just go on ahead and do the game booby dooby doop and then miss something. It's like it'll be like that mental baggage from Psychonauts. Just oh, okay, it didn't miss anything. Where? I just literally, I could have sworn I got it during my, tour, my third re-recording of that episode 18. But nope, that Boyd's mind, that Milkman Conspiracy meant hat bag, just had to go back in the boys episode and get it. That was just a fun moment. Okay, but there Fine we are. Fellas, effective at burning Girl. everything to a crisp. Especially those slugs, I bet. Yeah, just... It's However not a good side, idea to have it where... The tank is notoriously unstable, given the right kind of persuasion. Yes. Once the flamethrowers are down, they're gonna explode. But yeah, the flamethrowers are some of the deadliest enemies in the game. Because they will take your minions out if you aren't careful. They will roast them. Any minions that aren't reds will be roasted. And the reds can't hurt them. Yes, you would think that the red minions would be pr perfect to take them on. Nope, the reds can't hurt them. Okay. Well, let's use that bomb and blow that door down. Go, minion. Place the bomb in front of the door. Wait for it to explode. Wait for it to explode. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, we're going to need to do this a few more times. A couple more times. Okay. Come on. I swear, if we had a few more bombs, this process would be a whole lot easier. Okay, good, good, good. Okay, come on. Why you put those barrels there? You're not gonna put anything in them. Oh, there was something in them. Okay, come on. Yeah, I know we have something. Okay, good. 277 strength. Let's get in here. Okay. The dwarves are fiercely secret about their brewing rituals. This fort must guard the brewery. So it does. Great, but now, oh, more pad. Let's do this. Let's get over to it. Okay. More pad. Gonna activate it. Okay, good. Now we have that little warp point. And, okay, I could have sworn that there was another area. I'm going to go back and check at the beginning because, really, I have my suspicions that I missed something. Because there will be an item that we wanted. Because I know that there's a tower object with a bunch of dwarves. That is one thing I know. And we will get it because I want to make sure that I get everything. We at least have the tower. We at least can go to the brewery in, in, at the very least in the next episode. So that's all good. So we'll just go simply go back to where those we'll simply go back to this to that one area. I think it's actually to the right. So yeah, we'll just go investigate, see if it's there. If it's not, oh well, so be it. And if it is, we'll benefit from it because we will collect it. Okay. Yeah, just putting on good minion spell. They always play by default on the highest fire spell, which, like I said, I don't like. I don't like in the slightest. Come on, we don't need this. Could have sworn. I could have sworn. Come on, minions. Yeah, if we lose a minion because of this, I am. It's gonna be. It's gonna go on the moment of Zar's Swamp greatness. Where I royally, royally, royally mess up. Okay. So I did. Okay. 
when I went to the right there, I did actually miss out on an area. I believe. So yeah, I keep... I could have sworn I went down this way and I found the area. I don't know. Come on. Okay. I walked in a big circle! I walked in a big circle! <laughs> Seriously, what is it with me? I am just disappointing myself half the time. Just, yeah, the greatness of Zarth Wob. I walked around in a circle. Freaking move over the art of war. I freaking you have Zarth Wob. That that's where it's at. Just me and my glorious wisdom. I'm just doing what I do. Okay. Yeah. There are two, there's some bugs right there. Such okay. a proud. Ah, there it is. Reduced to servitude. <laughs> Sometimes even gods have a sense of humor. Okay. Yes. I did actually miss out. See? I. It was good that I checked. Our women. They took them. I know not where. Where do Gorda want, Gorda want those ugly elf women? Talk about nature. See, look at that. A minion spell. Over there, I think. I think that's a minion spell. So I need to see. Okay. Prepare yourself. Steal yourself, minions. For we will strike now. But, first, let's just move that little container. Okay. Okay, good. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Minions, what the heck? Those two, those three minions, they, they, they just... They disappoint me. Seriously, what the, what the heck happened? Oh, this is another gimmick of the dwarves. When dwarves are drunk, when dwarves drink beer, they Most become stronger. Be oh, look at that wizard man. Take note it's of him. Potent stuff. Yeah, but just beware of the dwarves and their beer, because like your minions, they'll receive like a defense. Minions, they'll receive an attack. Dwarves are never more ferocious than when they've had a drink. So, watch out, sire. Okay, good. Charge. Yes, we need to get our minions charged. Come on. Come on. Charge! Come on, I know that this is a horrible strategy, and I know that it's horrible. Come on. We can win this. We can win this through sheer numbers. It's like that it's like that scene in Ants. Where they're fighting the termites and they're just so horribly outnumbered. They where they're so horribly outskilled and yet they have numbers. Okay. <laughs> it's like Artemis. Because <laughs> you're going to be the one minion. <laughs> you're going to be like... <laughs> How is it? I can't feel my legs. <laughs> okay, minion spell, good. We have won this battle. A new minion spell. Okay, good. We got our level 3 minion spell. See, this is why I wanted to do this. Okay. Come on. Okay, not my proudest moment. You are gonna lose minions in that area. You are gonna lose minions to the dwarves. I'm sorry, it's gonna happen. But yeah, sure the slugs are gonna be out, but the slugs are nothing compared to just the wrath of a drunken dwarf. Ugh, could you imagine taking all those dwarves on with several of them drunk? Even more than drunk than they already were? <laughs> sure, it's one thing when you're taking on a single drunk dwarf, now, when you're taking on several at the same time, that is when you are risking your life. Okay. Come on, minions. Come on. Okay. Yeah, we're going to need to lead them through because the camp is going to be swarming with dwarves. I hate that this is one of the few places in the game where enemies actually respawn. Okay. Good. Good. 
Oh, come on. Stay away from my minions. Come on. Kill him. Kill him. Slaughter. Good. Good. Come on. Why? Why are you always... This is our cell. So keep away. They are to begin with. Come on. I hate how they freeze for that brief second when you just accidentally lock on them. I hate that. Well, it's a precious second or two. But yeah, we got our level 3 minion spell. This is going to give us even more power behind it. And it's better than level 2 because sure, the minions will be out of control. But at least they'll have even more power to them. Okay. And... Ah, boom. The Legion of Terror spell. Now, this works like berserk, only it comes with the added bonus of inducing fear in foes and friendlies alike. Very oh, nice. That's good for a giggle, that one. <laughs> okay, basically, the level 3 spells are special in that they reflect your corruption levels. Where, if you, where, as you saw, I got Legion of Terror. Where, it just has that evil element to it. Just, it's more evil, it's the more diabolical spell. And the reason I got it was because I have a very high corruption level. However, if you have a very low corruption level, like 0%, you're doing one of those no corruption runs, you're going to get a power that is known as the Legion of Honor, which basically is like the whole, which basically will, is like the Legion of Terror, except it, the minions won't be attacking your, won't be attacking friendly NPCs. So yeah, it's a trade-off. It's like it's more or less like it's displaying a more good style. Like the the good, where just all the spells are going to be very similar in that regard. So yeah, if so yeah, just play both playthroughs if you really want to see like all the effects. Okay, good, 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 good. Come on, come on, we can do this. I want to at least get in the group. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Yeah, I want to wait. Yeah, I want to wait for that one bomb to explode because my back was turned. These guys, this is how you're getting into this place. You're going to wait for this bomb thrower. He's going to throw a bomb at you. And you send your minion. And he picks it up. And you run the bomb over to the door. And you blow it down. Simple as that. Oh, goody! That's very nice of him. Just throwing it right at the entranceway. That's very, very polite of him. Okay, good. Run, minion, run! He knows what happens to the He knows what happens to bad little minions who don't run fast enough. Okay, good. And we'll actually be getting into the door. Okay, two, two. Where'd you two come from? No, no. He at least died doing what he loved. Protecting the door from guards. Oh, I don't care. I don't care if I was a minion. And look at that. That's a big dwarf. He look at him. He has an axe. He's kind of adorable. Look at him. Look at him with his stubby little arms and his stubby little eyes. He's adorable. Who's a little killer dwarf? You are. You are. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, I'll stop baby talking to the dwarves. Oh, come on. Come on. We may have lost some minions, but we can continue on. Come on. We can take him. Come on, come on. Come on! Come on, get out of here! Oh, good. Good, we made it. Okay, we got our number. We got a little more life force back. That's good, that's good. We need to get the minions back up to strength. Okay. Okay, come on. Okay. Wait for it. And swarm! Wait, 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 no, run, 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 run back! Run back! Come on. Seriously, they come out of nowhere. Come on. Oh, come on! We lost We lost our minion to the dwarves! Oh, come Come on! 
I will do my legendary strategy of just throwing minions at it until it dies. It's a, it's a strategy that's worked for me so far, and it will continue to work for me. Seriously, what is it with all these dwarves that keep ambushing me? They keep on just charging out. Come, oh, come on. This is just horrible. Come on. Come on. I, I know this is going to be a longer episode, but I need to win this. Come on. Come on. Okay. With that little conflict done, I think it's a good time to end the episode off. I really appreciate that you stuck around to watch this video. You're a great viewer, and I hope you come back for the next one. So if you like this video, like, subscribe, comment, share, do whatever it is that you want. And with that, I will see you later. Bye.